So go down the hallway. I don't know if you noticed, but when we walked in, this is a barn door. And I've got two of them in the house, actually. We were going to put a pocket door here, but I saw in a magazine the barn door. I thought it was really cool. And it opens up into our utility room, which is very small. I've got an ironing board in the wall and a shower for Kim when he comes in all dirty from the garden. And, of course, my washer and dryer. And then this door is, leads to the garage. Which still has some work that needs to be done to it. But we're getting there. Going down the hallway. This is just a little closet here. This is my only storage closet. Well, besides the bedroom. So there's not very much room in there. Four feet wide, and I guess it's probably about 12 or 14 feet deep. It needs some organization, but got everything in there for now. I mean, we've only been in here nine days, so eventually I'll get to the storage closet. This is the guest bathroom, which I think is very cute. This um, vanity was made by one of the fellows in our church, Dick, who's very talented with woodworking. And we had had an old uh, cedar tree fall down years ago, which we had sawn up into boards, didn't know what we would do with them. Uh, Kim thought maybe we might want to make a cedar chest, but as it turned out, they were perfect for the cabin. So he created this um, vanity for us, with, we put, put the copper sink on and also some end tables and coffee tables in the great room he also made for it. Just think of this cute little room. This is one of the, that's what I thought was going to be a sofa table but it ended up being in the hallway that Dick made for us. This is the extra bedroom. Which I've decorated with windmill, a windmill theme. I love windmills. So, not a lot of room, but just what we need. And I also put my computer in here. My big computer. A few pictures that I brought of the kids. And my printer behind the door. And of course, the nativity scene that I've had for years and years and I couldn't part with. And then, our master uh, suite. We have a closet here. And, and this is our bedroom, which I th th thought turned out really pretty. I love it. It has a beach theme, which is... Um, actually, I took that picture, um, North Carolina, Emerald Isle, years ago. So this is our bedroom. And again, the other barn door, which I think was really cool. I want you to notice the window treatments, which I think... Kim went out and cut some walnut limbs for me and hung them on the windows. I think they're rather charming. And then the bathroom. There's my copper tub that I've wanted all these years. Beautiful. I haven't taken a bath in it yet. I gotta get some wax on it first. Uh, a hand, a beautiful painting by one of my friends that I went to college with, who lives in North Carolina. Toilet, of course. And then here is our sink area. A lot smaller than what we have in the other house, but 
plenty of room to do what we need to do. And then here's the shower, which is beautiful. I think he did a really nice job with tiling. It has a little seat. When we get old and decrepit, we need a place to sit. We have a seat there. So there you have it. Brief, brief little video tour of the new gray cabin. Come see us sometime.